happening right now at six o'clock, a tribute to the late Congressman John Lewis. Here's a live look from Washington, D.C., where people are paying their respects to Lewis at the Capitol Rotunda. Lewis will lie in state there for the rest of the day before returning to Atlanta tomorrow for memorial services and his funeral. CBS 46's Adam Murphy is live in our nation's capital tonight, speaking with people who have been there really waiting in line for hours, Adam, to pay their respects. Good evening, Tracy. Thousands of people have lined up outside the United States Capitol in order to bid farewell to the late congressman. And at times, that line has wrapped around the Capitol grounds. He just believed in humanity. Yes, he did. We left at 730. It's the historical occasion. It's a moment in time captured forever. That's a nice picture. I feel like he's still talking to you. <laughs> Robin Bennett will always remember this day. And so will her daughter, Chantel. He was just big. He's bigger than life. When we got together, what John Lewis liked to hear the most was, Blue fight! You know! That was the favorite thing. That's what he liked. Good guy. They made the trip to our nation's capital, like thousands of others, to honor a civil rights icon. If he can, uh, you know, march across that bridge in Selma, I'll, I'll stay here for hours to, to honor him. To honor that man right there, that's a blessing. To see the walk through here, I'm teleworking. I took off just to do this because I want to show that my solidarity to him and to black people, white people, green people, purple people. This is the final day on Capitol Hill for John Lewis. Yeah after losing his battle with cancer. A United States representative for 34 years. This was such a historical experience that we wanted to be a part of. And a freedom fighter for life. And John Lewis did so much for not only minorities, but the entire country. And we just wanted to be a part of it. I never met John Lewis when he was alive, so I said, I'll meet him today. The time has come for the late congressman to leave Capitol Hill and make the journey back to Atlanta, where he will be laid to rest. Live in Washington, D.C., Adam Murphy, CBS 46 News. Adam, thank you. Lewis will be honored here in Atlanta following the tributes there in Washington, D.C. The congressman expected to arrive at the state capitol around 2 p.m. for a special ceremony. Then his casket, his body will lie in state tomorrow night through Thursday morning. Lewis's private funeral will be Thursday at Ebenezer Baptist Church. Make sure you stay with us here at CBS 46 on air and online as we continue our coverage as the nation honors and remembers Congressman John Lewis. <laughs>